One of the big election races we're following is the fight for the U.S. Senate seat in our state. And tonight we have a new exclusive poll showing a continuing trend in that contest. And 24 Hour News 8's Rick Albans here with a look at those numbers. Yeah, this is the time of year we start watching for trends less than five weeks. When longtime Senator Carl Levin announced that he was retiring, it might have opened the floodgates for people to make a run for the office instead. Both Republicans and Democrats quickly eliminated the possibility of a primary and settled on their candidates. Tonight, the latest numbers from our pollsters at Epic MRA say that 42% of you would vote for Democrat Gary Peters if the election were held today. 33% would choose Republican Terry Lynn Land. That's three points better for Peters compared to the same poll last month where he led 45-39. Interestingly, both candidates have dropped some support in this survey. If you look at the trend line starting last year, the race showed some volatility with first Peters, then land trending up, and with that changing with on a somewhat regular basis. Since May, however, the trend has been for Peters with various polls showing him up from a few points to double digits. In 25 polls since May, Land has only led in two as compiled by Real Clear Politics. Like the governor's race that we featured last night that showed Governor Rick Snyder breaking outside the margin of error, this poll too is well beyond the margin of plus or minus 4%. The 600 people surveyed through Monday are all likely voters, and so now, the candidates have less than five weeks to either change their minds to change the trend line or keep them in their column between now and November 4th. And this race, as with the governor's race, as with all of those other races, likely to intensify because we still have single digits in all of these races. That's true. And not long. Five yeah. weeks. You know, it five weeks is, yeah. on one hand, it goes by in a heartbeat, but it's still kind of a long time in politics. You can change a lot of things depending on how much money you have, right. what your message is, how often you can get it out. So five weeks is long enough to do something, but it, it will feel like about 30 minutes when I come back and sit down and say, well, tonight's the night. Because that's, <laughs> that's it, right. it goes by that quickly. Yeah. Okay. Right. Thank you, Rick. Thanks, Thank Rick.